Wes Bentley, it's so good to talk to you, my man. How you been? Oh, I'm doing well. How are you doing? I'm so I'm so happy to be here. Thank you for having me. Dude, absolutely. I have been so excited to see season four. And the funny thing is I have friends that are ranchers. We're out here in Texas, friends that have never even been to a farm that live here in the city of Houston. And absolutely everybody across the board, so excited about season four of Yellowstone, man. Because I love to hate Jamie. I mean, because there's times I really want to root for him. But then there's this underlying feeling that he just can't be trusted. What are your thoughts on that? I, I mean, that's a, I definitely don't think you can trust him, <laughs> but I also don't think you can trust any of the Duttons. So it's, uh, they're kind of in that situation. So he's, you know, he's plays, playing a game of, 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 of keeping himself safe sometimes by those moves, but also, you know, okay, he's trying to get the ranch too. Everybody wants the ranch. So, um, I don't know if you can always trust them. <laughs> what can fans expect going into season four? Because I've gotten to see the first three episodes so far. And man, I'm telling you, those first 12 minutes of episode one are probably the most intense scenes I've ever seen on a television show. So what can fans expect going into season four? Well, well you nailed it. That first episode is just wild and full of energy, right where we left off with more. I mean, I'm with you, I, I read it when I read it, I had to put it down over and over again, the first episode, because I couldn't catch my breath. It was so intense and so pointed. You know, it's just like um it's got a clear direction and it's uh it's it's great. So I think the fans can expect that and they can expect the 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 battle is here. It's it, the the trenches are are getting deeper, the the fight is happening and the danger is is more intense than ever yeah taylor sheridan has done a great job with this series i'm looking forward to the spinoff and the prequels as well do you have a favorite memory from the set of yellowstone i was talking mm -hmm. to kelsey and she was talking about how she just enjoyed like having pancakes with the crew in the morning sometimes but i didn't know if you had a special memory that you've had so far in the first four seasons of filming well, yeah, I mean, they've all been special. The, the first one had a real special air about it because we were kicking it off and, and trying to this great project on, on the page. We wanted to get it all together. So I, I think my my fondest memories are the early rehearsals of putting it together and and working out with uh, fellow cast members and with Taylor, you know, who are these guys and what do they want and, and all those things, you know, like because that that I knew was just going to be the foundation of something really interesting. So I, I, I look back at that finally and I often refer to it when I'm and when I'm kind of trying to trying to play something different in the scene or whatnot. Uh, this next yeah. part is going to be a season three spoiler. So anybody that's watching right now, if you haven't seen season three, yet, go ahead, skip forward about a minute and a half. But do you feel that Jamie has been betrayed from his family because we find out that he is adopted? and that he isn't actually part of the Dutton clan. And by finding that out, when you're reading the script, did you change the way that you approached the character in any way once you read that? Well, oh, yeah, I mean, it was, um, yeah, it was, it's shocking. You know, it's, um, and, and for Jamie, it's everything. Because for Jamie, truly, what he really wanted was the respect of everyone. And he's, you know, he, the, the ranch is what the goal is, but the, but the, but the real goal inside is to get the respect from those he wants respect from, which is John and the rest of the family. Also, because he feels like he's worked hard to keep this ranch in the family. So, um, you know, I think he feels owed, you know, and, and, and his, it's come and due. And now that he has no foundation at all and, and, and finding out what he found out, um, you know, it sends him on a downward spiral that um with no ground under him you know and so that's where the danger comes from and so yeah now i have to approach it entirely differently because because of that like a foundation and the desperation gets more and that's been the hardest thing to play but that's who he is so it's tricky but it's you know it's so well written it's easy to play but it was it was such an interesting surprise and i, I loved playing it because it was everything to him Absolutely. I can't wait to see where your character Jamie Dutton goes in this series. I'm hoping that maybe he's even involved in the prequels or spinoffs, fingers crossed, whatever happens. And I just want to wish you the best of luck with season four. Huge fan here. People down here in Texas are really appreciating it. So thank you for making this season, man. Appreciate it. Well, thank you. And thank everybody for, for, for watching the show. It, we, you know, we love it and we're glad you love it too. The ranch comes first. And you forgot that. 
Bring your best. And I'll bring mine. 